I'm currently behind the wheel of a 2021 Ram 1500 TRX. And if you look at this area here, you can tell that well, things are a little different than on your average Ram 1500. I wanted to take the opportunity to show off this TRX button here. So you press it and it brings up this screen here, which is a great use of this 12 inch infotainment screen that comes standard in the TRX and here is where you can access all of your different drive modes this is kind of like a dashboard for all your different drive modes you can cycle through them here and that cycles through them in the gauge cluster but right here you've got to look at all eight of them so your standard mode is auto you've also got sport tow snow mud and sand rock and Baja in addition to a custom mode that you can configure and then these guys are all of your different components or vehicle areas that are configurable. So I accidentally just touched the snow button and you can see what changes. The transmission goes to a snow setting and the stability control goes to full. So in auto mode, everything's in street and the paddle shifters are on. Let's look at sport mode. Everything changes. Everything goes to sport. Tow. So the transmission goes into a tow mode. Steering changes up, stability control goes to full, mud and sand, so the steering goes to a rock setting, suspension goes to a Baja setting, that's interesting, transmission and stability control go to sport, and rock mode, I think it needs to be in four low for rock mode, that's why. Uh, you can go to Baja, which is my favorite setting. Transmission goes into Baja, stability control goes into Baja, suspension goes into Baja, steering goes to sport, and then I guess you can turn the paddle shifters off if you wanted to. I don't know why you'd want to, but they've remained constant throughout all of these. Here's custom, and here we'll go to custom setup, and there you can see all the different settings for all five of the configurable areas. So yeah, you can turn paddle shifters off, which maybe if you find yourself accidentally pressing them, I don't know why you'd want to turn them off though. Transmission has three different modes, sport, tow, and street. Stability control has settings for street, sport, and rock. Suspension has street, sport, and Baja modes. And then steering has street, sport, and rock. Uh, I'm told that in street, that's like your default setting, obviously. Sport, this gets a little heavier. And then in rock, this gets a little lighter. It doesn't actually change the ratios. It just changes the feel of doing this. So, yeah. Uh, not much else. Like I said, 8-speed transmission, 6.2 liter supercharged V8. Makes 702 horsepower, 650 pounds-feet of torque. Uh, you've got a manual shift mode for that 8-speed transmission. And then... As I referenced many times, these paddle shifters, which are metal, feel pretty hefty. They're set up correctly, get into an F-150 Raptor, and they're actually set up for towing, meaning that they will lock out gears rather than change gears, if that makes sense. In the TRX here, they're set up like they are in a sports car, which I think is how they should be in these high-performance off-road trucks. So, some different settings here performance pages take a moment to load take more than a moment to load there you go plenty of different metrics there some useful let's be honest some probably aren't yeah race options so there's a launch control setting. There's a setting here where you can turn a shift light on. So you can say at what RPM you want the shift light to appear. So this would all be set for the shift light to come on at 6,000 RPM. You can move that up or down. And then there's a race cooldown screen as well. So quick look at all the different performance pages and the different modes in the TRX here. There's also a launch button that once you're in the launch control, you can, I think the car needs to be, there you go. So you can just push this button for launch control. You've got four wheel drive auto is your default setting for high, for low, and then there's a rear locker. They can actually be turned on and left on at any speed, which is nice for some high speed off-road situations, but you really only, really need it for low speed, rough stuff. So, yeah, 
that is 2021 Ram TRX performance buttons and settings and pages and everything. Thanks for watching.